How to add Shopify color swatches on product page for beginners. Hey guys, welcome back. In this video, I'm showing you how you can add Shopify color swatches on a product page. So let's get into it. First of all, what you have to do is you will simply log into your Shopify account and you will get to your admin right here. If you do not have an account on Shopify, you can create one using your email address or using your Google account. So when it comes to our Shopify products and pages, you know that sometimes you go to a store and you want to check out different colors of a product. So how to add that on your Shopify store where your customers will be able to check out different colors, variants of a product available. So it's actually really easy to do and we can do this within our products. So for that, we'll go to products. Let's add a new product. For that, we will hit this button at the top. And now you can see I'll be able to add a new product. So first of all, let's give our product a name. I'm just going to call it a hoodie. Then we have to add description. So I'm just going to write the word description here. Then we have our media. So this is where you need to add images. And because we are actually going for different colors, so make sure to add the images in different colors for example if you are selling a hoodie so make sure to add different images of all the colors that's what i will do too so we'll click on upload new and i will upload some of the images and there you go we have our media uploaded so uh, now you can see we have images scroll down for more details we have to add pricing so this is where we add pricing for our product for example i'm selling this product for this price then we have cost per item so i'm just gonna go here and add it perfect moving on we have inventory now these are some of the you know compulsory option that you need to fill in for a basic product so for example i'll go to shipping here and we can add the weight of the product so once you add all of the information this is the option where you add colors and this is where you can add colors for a product so you hit add options so we have size color material and style these are the variants that we can create for a product i will be going for color so in color, this is where you will add your color options, like whatever color is available, this is where you will add it. So we have black, we have yellow, and red. Okay, so these are my variants, these are the colors that are available. If I hit done, you will be able to see now we have our colors created for a product, we have our variants created. So for each variant, we can not only, you know, create the colors, but now I can even add details such as the pricing. We can add different pricings for each variant. I can add the availability on hand, SKU. So for availability, let's actually go for maybe 10 of these products are available, 10 to 11. Similarly, I'm going to add the availability for this one, this one. If you sell, uh, you know, colors in different pricing, you can, for example, our black one, is a little bit expensive just a little bit because this one is a you know popular products so i'm just gonna go with this one so you can see this is what it looks like now even if i want to edit it out any of the variants from here any of the colors i can click on edit and i can edit it in detail uh, so for now you can see this is our options and we can even have the delete option here you can see click delete and you'll be able to delete it completely now we have our search engine here. Uh, this is what it looks like here. Now, let me actually show you, I can create more variants into it, not just the colors, but the sizes. So for that, I'm going to add more option. Click on size. For sizes, I am going with small, medium, and I'm going for large. Done. So uh, this is what it looks like. Now you can see I have more variants created and we even have SKUs and barcodes and everything. So this is what it looks like. So you can see now my variants are created. This is how easy it is to create colors and variants. Click on save and your changes will be saved. And I'll show you a preview of how this looks on a product page. So now you can see it's created. We will click on preview. So you can see here we have our product, our price, and we have color. And this is where I can check my different colors available and we have the images. Now this is like the basic way to add colors to a product page on Shopify.
There is another way you can do this if you are looking for something more, you know, with effects or animation. Then what you need to do is you will go to add apps. If you want to customize it completely, so you can just go to the app store and we'll hit Shopify app store here. So this is our Shopify app store and I'm going to search for color swatches and there you go. Now this is going to be a little bit more uh you know animated version and a better version of creating a color swatch or variant image uh, so how to create a variant i showed you but this one is more if you want to add an app so there are different uh you know apps available for free and then some are paid here so the one i like is this one so you can go with uh this one pl product color swatches so i'm gonna select it and we're gonna hit install so this is our app i'm gonna click on install app so our app is added now. At this side of the screen, you can see we have the product color, product groups, widget settings, appearance, and more. So from here, we're going to go to the product groups. Within your product groups, you will be able to create groups and you can then add different colors to it, different images. And this way, you can create color swatches. When it comes to selecting a color swatch app, you can also go with the other ones. You can go with the free one uh, if you want to. And this way you will have your own color swatches ready on your product page. This actually helps our customers select the right product. They can check the image and they can kind of like make their decision. This will help you sell more products. And this way you can create more variants of a product that is already available. Now, uh, you can also do this with the products that you already have in your inventory you don't need to create a new product every time so you can just go to the edit option and you can also perform the bulk action to create variants if you create variants first and then adding those products to that app and creating swatches will be very easy for you and even if you do not want to add any app you can do this manually by adding images and then adding the color links and this way you will be able to create swatches with your Shopify store that will actually improve the user experience and improve the quality of your store. So yeah, guys, this brings us to the end of the video. I hope that I was a big help to you. And now you know everything that you wanted to know. And don't forget to uh, share this video with your friends and family members so they can also get the information they want to. Also, you can subscribe to the YouTube channel. The button will be given right down below. Go ahead and subscribe to the YouTube channel. Also, hit the notification bell so every time you get notified when we post a video. So yeah, also leave a comment down below. What was your favorite part and what did you learn from this video or if you have any question.